This the Chinese virus, the China virus. And because of that, people are reacting that we Asians are to blame. A disturbing rise in attacks against Asian Americans continues to happen across the country, including right here in San Diego. Good evening and thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Steve Price. And I'm Alicia Summers. Dozens of incidents have been reported across San Diego County. A recent study based on police reports says there's been a 150% increase of these incidents in 16 of America's largest cities. News Ace LaMonica Peters tells us how Governor Gavin Newsom is addressing attacks on Asian Americans and some steps some of San Diego's community leaders are taking. In January, an elderly Asian man was assaulted and later died after an attack in San Francisco. And here in San Diego, an 80-year-old Filipina was attacked while riding the trolley. Now communities in California are sounding the alarm and coming together to report attacks on Asian Americans. Since the pandemic started, over 3,000 hate incidents across the country have been directed towards Asian Americans, according to police. President Biden spoke about it last week as he addressed the nation. Vicious hate crimes against Asian Americans who've been attacked, harassed, blamed, and scapegoated. Governor Newsom and the California legislature also addressed the issue last week, allocating $1.4 million to help fund efforts by Stop AAPI Hate. The group works to report bias and hate incidents against Asian American Pacific Islanders. A Filipino community leader in San Diego says the rise in attacks is directly related to President Trump. Kung flu. Yeah. The China virus. There has been over 40 reports of possible hate crimes against Asians. The most recent that we know of was a, against a 80 year old Filipina uh, Lola. Uh, she was riding on the MTS trolley from southeastern San Diego to downtown on a Monday morning, and she was attacked by a passenger, just random. Phil says police later deemed the trolley attack could not be labeled a hate crime. San Diego County Planning Commissioner Tommy Howe says he also wrote a letter to San Diego's Human Relations Commission. I'd like the Human Relations Commission and potentially also the council and the mayor to begin holding hearings as soon as possible, neighborhood hearings uh, around the city uh, with neighborhood stakeholders, with, with different Asian American groups, organizations, businesses, to talk about um, the, con the issues of hate and intimidation and violence that have occurred and may have gone unreported. Both Howe and Field say they want to bring law enforcement agencies into this conversation so that more of these incidents can be called hate crimes, which carry a tougher penalty.